Hi, this is Nitin Chandra. In this video, I'll show you how to add MailChimp sign-up form to your website. So let's get started. Let's hit Google saying MailChimp. Click on the first link saying MailChimp.com. MailChimp send better mails. Okay. You'll be landed to MailChimp.com. Let's log in into this. If you don't have an account, create an account. If you already have an account, let's log in. Okay. Yeah. Once you're logged in, you're landed into dashboard. We'll create a list. For the first thing to add sign up form, we need a list. We'll create a list here. Click on the list. I already have a, a list, sign up list, but I'll create a new list to create sign up form. Create new list, create list. We'll add this as demo. You can you can give anything whichever uh, whichever uh, name you want, like uh, maybe like your name, company name, or uh, uh, your uh, personal blogging name, everything. Okay, from. Nitin Chandra email info dot Nitin Chandra is our gmail dot com Oops, sorry Chandra okay some subject name mm, you need to check whether it's not spammy or not we can give the subject name later I'll just create a uh, 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 we'll just add, uh, which we'll leave it, leave it for now. We'll say that here uh, remind people how they got into your list. Yeah, we'll say you are receiving this email because you have opted. In my website then chandra sr dot com okay can add your company name your address uh, postal address your country name phone number okay I'll just save this okay excellent your um, your uh, list got added up and you can see that one here if you want you can uh, you can delete the list if you want okay we'll uh, we'll click on the list you can invite the people uh, yeah you can see the subscribers how many open rates for the list if you have sent uh, uh, if you have sent email emails to this this particular list okay we'll click on demo marketing list now Okay, you got uh, a bigger view of all the things. Demo mar marketing dashboard, where you can see the stats, um, manage subscribers, unsubscribe people, groups, segments, subscriber exports, and everything. Now we need sign up forms. Yeah, it's uh, the sign up forms are here. We click on sign up forms. Okay, uh, there is a embed forms here. It, it will generate a HTML code to embed on in your site or blog to collect sign ups. We'll select this one. Okay. Okay, uh, in embedded form code, uh, uh, you'll learn to em how to embed the f for sign up form onto your website. Uh, you'll have uh, many options like classic, super slim, naked, and advanced. Classic will have all the uh, all the fields like email address, first name, and last name. Uh, and uh, here you can see the, the title of the form. You can change the title of the form saying like if you change, subscribe to my blog. subscribe to my blog let's get changed here that's cool right okay um, fine so you can you can select all the fields or uh, only required fields if, uh, based on your requirement um, and you can set the form width and everything I will set the form width to 400 uh, for now to change yeah you can see the change in changing effects on the preview preview pane okay I'll revert it back 
okay if you want if you want the code uh, you can uh, you can copy this code uh, this is the code for uh, for classic uh, sub uh, sign up form uh, but like we'll we'll go through other options super slim option and naked option okay so super slim option will have only a uh, uh, email address and a subscribe button uh, like it's simpler way to get a uh, user's attention and uh, uh, there is only one email address and just a subscribe button people just add the email address and just say subscribe okay uh, here also we can set the uh, uh, form width and everything uh, uh, you can change the now uh, title of the form uh, or else you can hide the title of the form and there is another option uh, and for this uh, super slim form you can you will have a code over here you can copy the code and paste it on your uh, uh, HTML document uh, there is a naked um naked form which is does which doesn't have any css applied to that one it's a simple form which can be uh which you, if you want to change the design for the buttons and uh text boxes you, you can write it over write it to this one um but i'll uh, but there's advanced option where you can have a custom css for your forms and you can have hidden fields and there is a api for apis for uh, custom forms custom sign up forms but we'll use super slim form for now um uh, i'll just say subscribe to my blog and um, i'll say i'll copy this code copy okay i'll open um ide i'll create a new new html document i'll say page type as html layout as none and document as html5 and and just say create okay once you're landed up here um we can paste the code copied uh, from the mailchimp.com i'll say paste okay uh, i'll save this document I'll just now I'll just name it as index.html. This is not necessary. You can can copy the uh, copy this code to your website wherever required. Uh, for instance, uh, in my in my website like www.natanchandra.com. Okay, uh, this is my website where I've placed a uh, sign up form uh, for to receive. Uh, you can uh, like you can engage engage the end users uh, by sending them the email email uh, email support regarding what you blog about and what you what you are doing on the current uh, technologies and everything. And there is a subscribe button here. You can add. Uh, I have added the similar uh, similar code which I just added uh, to my website here. Uh, you can place it over to any of the uh, wherever required okay uh, i'll just save this and i'll will preview this in browser okay um you got a you got a um you got a s sign up form on your html document this uh, this sign up form doesn't have any css applied uh, you this css will be applied once you host the this page or to the server or your uh, domain or anything um yeah uh, okay i have inserted a sign up form which which i just sim which which i just uh, created now similar to in in my website uh, i will check this over here i can uh, okay i'll show you here view page source let's say mailchimp okay yeah you can see here um there is a form form and input field and uh, input submit type uh, button or uh, subscribe uh, subscribe button um uh, i i've added a uh, i've added a class uh, to change the color and uh, design of the button you can see there is it's a it's kind of a light pink color one uh, a subscribe button with rounded corners and uh, with uh, with all the effects gradient effects uh, uh, i've added that one in a uh, uh, button and all button css class and you can you can change the css of the button uh, if, uh, if required okay uh, we'll just say i'll just say info at uh, info dot uh, nitin chandra h a n d r a s a at gmail dot com okay and okay uh, I'll just click on subscribe okay it will be landed to different 
different page where you can say it's almost finished we, we need to confirm your email address so we'll log in into our uh, uh, my account I'll just say info at netinchandrasar at gmail dot com oops ok fine uh, we'll say yeah yeah here we got a newsletter uh, we need a confirmation of the subscription of my new newsletter please confirm your subscription I'll just click yes subscribe to me to this list once you subscribe once you click on that one um, your subscription is confirmed our confirmation page has come has come um, your subscription to, to our list has been confirmed and thank you for subscribing you can add your uh, it, it adds up your uh, uh, local postal address and uh, you can say continue to our website uh, it will come back to my website again and uh, to see like uh, this has been confirmed uh, I will go to MailChimp and uh, that list was created in Nitin Chandra's newsletter so I'll click on the list ok yeah you can see here info at Nitin gmail dot com is added to my list yeah this is how uh, you can you can get uh, valid uh, valid subscribers to your website and uh, uh, this is a legal way to create uh, email campaigning and creating a, a contact list to your uh, website or, or any of your product or anything. Uh, that's it guys. Uh, uh, thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. Uh, to know more about me, you can visit my website www.nitinchandrayasa.com. Thank you.